questers. Today's quest is we're going to Cellar 55 in Fuquay. It's a nice local bottle shop, uh, wine shop. You can also uh, have pints of beer, glasses of wine, and it has an automated bartending system. Let's go check it out. They probably have the biggest wine selection in the Fuquay area for sure. It's pretty amazing. Wall to wall. And very knowledgeable too. And they're actually doing a tasting today so you can come in and try some wine. But yeah, let's take a look at the beer. So just next to the wine they have a small can and bottle area. You can mix and match your own six packs. Uh, ooh. These are the guys I like. Breakfast stout, steak cake stout. Ooh, Imperial Wedding Cake Break. Uh, I think I'm definitely gonna have to get that. As well as this Bakery Bourbon Barrel Aged Imperial Stout. Oh yeah, and it's about time for the pumpkin beers. Let me see if I can find any pumpkin beers. Okay, so we did find, uh, there's an Oktoberfest Mars in. There's Sycamore Pumpkin Latte Blonde. Interesting. Blonde ale with coffee and spices. I don't like my pumpkin beers too spicy. I like the kind of sweet pumpkin pie flavor to it. Not too much cinnamon and nutmeg to cover it up. How do you like your pumpkins? A really cool part of Cellar 55, in my opinion, is you can come to these beer coolers, take out any single serving beer you want, they'll pop it open for you, and you can just have a beer. And what is kind of crazy about that is the prices are really good because you can buy these to take them home as well. But if you buy them in the cooler, it's only 99 cents more for them to open and drink it here, where wine is $25 per bottle to open it. So not really worth it there, but the beer, so worth it. Most of these beers are gonna be six bucks, some $7, you know, at a craft brewery, um, or rather any restaurant that serves craft beer. So this is a great deal. Just for example, the prices here and why I think this place is amazing is I had Double Barley Gourd Rocker just a couple days ago and it was $6.75 at that bar. Here, after tax, this bottle cost me $4.28. That includes the corking fee, so they had to order, open the bottle for you. But you take it out of the cooler, nice and cold, and it's a 99 cent upcharge. This was only three something, so it comes out to 428 after tax. What a gr amazing deal. Also, only in Fuquay will dentists advertise on pint glasses. And they do have a seating area. You can order like small apps. And we'll take a look at the drink machines. So what they do here is you can get a little card and come over here, you grab a glass touch your card, the symbol there, and you can simply select whatever beer you want and how much you want it to pour, whether it be a small taste or a full pint, and it'll automatically pour it for you and keep uh, your tab on that card. It's pretty amazing. You can also do growler fills, 32, 64 ounce. Got some games for you to play. The game we like to play is Shut the Box. It's a dice game where you would roll, you get an eight. So for example, you're trying to shut all these numbers down so you could do a three and a five. And you try to do it all the way, shut down one through 12. It's very hard and very rare to get all the numbers shut down. And there's a nine, so you could just do a nine. Yeah, you have to be very lucky. Steph wins it a lot more than I do. All right, so I'm gonna show how the wine wall works. You can actually see the bottles they have in there. And they have the prices. 
So you can do it. You can do it. Taste. Two point five ounce. Five ounce. So you take your card with a chip. Slide it in, and you can see what you would like to select. We're going to do this guy right here. I don't dare know how to pronounce that. Well, let's do a taste. Excuse the camera. So we hit taste. Automatically fill it up. It'll blow out the wine so you get every last drop. And you're good to go. So that was a dollar fifty-five for one point five ounce taste. Here's a quick look at their small bites menu. We've been trying going down the wine wall trying a few uh, white wines and we ordered the caprese just simple cherry tomatoes mozzarella balsamic vinegar this is really cool fortnite electric overdrive that's one of the cooler cans i've seen <laughs> not quite sure what type of beer it is but they have a tasting today and you get them for 10 10 percent off Ooh, farmhouse pumpkin Sometimes they'll have food trucks out back here, but uh, today they don't have anything. So we went ahead and ordered Indian from the uh, place next door, Zira. It's really good. So we got some uh, chicken butter masala. I'm excited. Mother I got extra spicy and Steph's not happy with me. So she has to go find a bottle <laughs> of something to cool down her mouth. She's mad at me now. The Indian food was a bit too hot for Steph and me too. So we ordered another order. Uh, this time we went extra mild, extra American, extra gringo. Take two on the Indian food for Steph. I got the extra spicy and they made it Indian hot spicy. Uh, it's pretty brutal. So I'm actually gonna take most of mine home to try to finish where I can cool it down hopefully. Uh, but Steph got some extra mild. It's so good. Looks a little iffy, but oh my goodness, it's so good. Highly recommend checking out Zero. They do a lunch buffet too, and it's absolutely amazing. How is it? Much better. <laughs> hey everyone, forgot to record an outro at Cellar 55, but we had an amazing time. They have such an awesome variety of beer and wine there. It's always a great experience. Those automated machines are amazing. Highly recommend you check it out. Uh, we never have a bad time ever at Cellar 55. Um, so definitely if you have a chance, swing by there. We also appreciate you watching these videos. Thumbs up, give us a like, uh, subscribe if you want. I'm sure most of you all know me, so hey everyone, and uh, enjoy your quest.